Hey, I'm Ashley Adams, and I'm in the business of buying junk and jazzing it up. Then I try to sell it for more than I paid. So we're coming up on a moving cell, guys, which means I have to make something so cool that they'll want to take it with them to their next home. It's a bit of a challenge, but let's see what we got. I don't really see anything out here, you guys, but I'm gonna bring the hammer on this episode. Let's go inside. So guys, this is a moving sale, which means literally everything in this house is for sale. It's all up for grabs. An expandable fork, or should we say selfie stick? Look at this jewelry selection. Where was this garage sale when we made our ear cuffs? Let's see, we got a record. Looks like house music. Give me some house music and post. What else we got here? Oh, this guy. What do we think about this guy? I kind of like him a lot. A vintage looking rustic window pane. I'm seeing so many things on Pinterest involving window panes. Let's see what I can give him for this one. Hi there. Hello, how you doing? Good, thank you, I'm Ashley. Cyrus, nice to meet Cyrus, you. Cyrus, good to meet you too. Um, this is a lovely garage sale. Thank you very much. Congratulations on the big move. Thank you, excited. Yeah. Um, just kind of curious, how much would it cost to take this baby off your hands? Cyrus originally wanted 30 for the window pane, but I got him to hand it over for 20 bucks. What a bargain. Perf. Thank you very much. Thank you, and congratulations Thank you again. Very much. See ya. See ya. Pretty sure they're not going to want to leave this guy behind once they see what I'm whipping up. Let's go back to the studio. Shabby Chic is a home decorating choice that is sort of timeless. I think I have the perfect idea to elevate that look in yours and Cyrus's home. Here's everything you'll need for this project. A window pane, chalkboard paint, a sponge brush, painters or masking tape, a heart foam sticker, mini clothespins, hot glue, wall hanging assembly kit. We're gonna start off this project by wiping off the entire surface of the window pane. This being a vintage one, it kind of already has the sought after character of rustic with the wear and the paint. So be careful and keep that in mind when wiping it. Great. After the surface is clean, tape off the part of the glass that you'll want to paint over with the chalkboard paint. All right. There's a couple different options in the acrylic paint section of your local craft store. This one is a multi-surface paint that goes on multi-surfaces. Once you have carefully taped off the correct area, Using a sponge brush, start painting the first coat of paint over the glass. Let dry, then paint a second or third coat if you like. I find painting to be a very soothing activity. Also, I'm thinking about adding a heart sticker to the bottom corner. So adhere the sticker to wherever you think elevates the project aesthetically. Okay, while that is drying, we're gonna take mini clothespins and glue them to the top part of the paint that is left unpainted. Hot glue is good because remember, if you ever want to remove these clothespins, it's not permanent. Right. Okay guys, final step. Let's assemble the hardware for hanging this bad boy on the wall. Stop, hammer time. Remove the tape and voila. This chic window pane is ready to go on the wall. I can't wait to see what Cyrus thinks. Okay, so we're back on Cyrus's porch and I'm really excited to see what he thinks about his brand new window pane chalkboard. It looks like Cyrus and his wife have great taste. Let's see how much dough I can get for this baby. Hello, Hello there. Hi, how you doing? hi, sir. How are you? Good. Good to see you. Thank you. Good to be back. Thank you. So, I took your window pane and turned it into a Chalkboard! <laughs> That's awesome. Do you like it? Yeah, I do. Oh my gosh, really? Yeah. Oh, awesome! It's really cool. I wasn't sure if shabby chic was you <laughs> in your lady's style, but knowing that information, how much would you be willing to spend on it? Um. Cyrus loved it so much, he wanted to buy it back from me for $35, but I was able to get $40. All right! Like 40. Yeah. Oh my gosh, that's awesome! The bargain price. There you go. All right, I'll take that. I'll hand this over to you, my thank, friend. Thank you very much. Oh my gosh, thank you very much. Thank you for coming by. Thank you, and good luck to you and your wife in your new house. Thank you, I appreciate it. Okay, bye. Bye-bye.
Well, I doubled my cashola. I think, guys, we can chalk this one up to a victory. See what I did there? Scene 2.1, take one. My secret talent, juggling. Ready? <laughs> okay, I really did not expect for it to hit me in the eye. <laughs>